Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to backup email on GoDaddy. So how do you backup your emails on GoDaddy? The first thing I'd like you to do is to launch your GoDaddy web account. And then the next thing is I'm going to show you how to create a GoDaddy account. For many browsers of your choice, head over to the top corner where you're going to find the search bar. In the search bar, type GoDaddy.com. Once you do that, click enter. That's going to take you to the official website for GoDaddy. Once you get to the official website, from the official website, check the top right corner, you're going to find sign up. Click on sign up and follow through the processes to create an account. Now, you might be asked to create an account manually or automatically using Google, Facebook, or Apple. Whichever one you choose that is most convenient for you, just create your account. And once you're done creating your account, it's going to take you to the GoDaddy homepage. This is not the homepage. Now, from the homepage, head over to the top right corner, you're going to find your profile name. Click on your profile name and you're going to see an extended menu. Right there, you're going to see my products. Click on my products and it's going to take you right into this page, which is the my product page. Now from here, let us see how we can back up email on GoDaddy. If I go to my account, all right, from this product, the email and office may not necessarily do justice to it. So I'm just going to have to head over to where we came from which is the GoDaddy homepage. So this is what the homepage looks like. All right, so. So this is the profile. This is your profile name. Click on that. And once you click on that, here now you find signing to Office 365 mail. You definitely need to sign in to your Microsoft Office 365 email. All right, and so once you go ahead and click on this, and if you have an account, all right, so let's say we're signing in, and um, here, okay, so I do not have a Microsoft 365 email, but if you do, just go ahead and click on that and then sign in. So once you have signed in successfully, all right, and you've entered your password and you sign in. Okay, so if it is your first time signing in, so here you go. So if it is your first time signing in, all you need to do is to select accept to allow email backup to access your Microsoft 365 account. All right, so go ahead and select accept and once you select accept, then you will now be able to access your Microsoft 365 account. Now, let's verify this using uh, the GoDaddy help page. So I'm just going to go all the way back. Okay. Okay, so here are options. All right. So now it means you have to all right sign in to email backup, and that's as an add-on. So go ahead and click on sign in to email backup. So here you go. The email backup add-on retains and can restore all mail, contact, and all this. So admins can sign in and manage this. So how exactly do you do that? Go to your email backup. Here's a hyperlink that you need to click on. Enter your Microsoft 365 email address. Enter your Microsoft 365 password. Select sign in. And if this is your first time signing in, select accept to allow email backup to access your Microsoft 365 account. So this is just all you need to do. So go ahead and click on email backup. And once you do that, just like the process that we went through. So select accept to allow email backup to access your Microsoft 5 account. And that's just going to be it. So you can go by this entire from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps. And once you're done, you'll be good to go. I hope this video 
help to search.